haven't done a uh, Metallica lesson in, in a while, so I thought I might do one. Um, this is gonna be Cyanide off of Death Magnetic. Now, I've seen a lot of requests for this song all over YouTube, so I thought I'd make a video. And uh, the way I'm gonna teach you is artist approved. Um, I got it right here out of this lovely book. Right here. And, um, yeah, so it's pro probably close to 100% accurate, I would hope. So, let's start the lesson. Now, now that intro, he uses a, a wah of, of effect thing. But basically, it's going to be like a D chord on the 7th fret. So, you're going to take your index finger. You're going to put it on the 7th fret 5th string. Ring finger, or uh, your, your middle finger, sorry. On the 3rd string, 7th fret. And your ring finger on the 8th fret fourth string and it's going to be and, and you'll get this that's what you uses the wah on so it's just going to be e string open three times okay and then a half gallop to that note here this uh, kind of g chord thing and then you're going to do that again you're going to do that three times and then you're just going to chug in with some gallops Okay, so the pattern is this. Okay, and then the drums will kick in. And then, uh, then the next riff, that... It's going to be 7th fret power chord on the 5th string, and you're going to strike that three times. Then you're going to lift off your ring finger, and then you're going to put your middle finger on the 8th fret 4th uh, string. Okay, you're going to strike that three times, and then you're going to bar down the 7th fret, the 5th and 4th string. You can bar it down or use two fingers. I, I recommend you use two fingers because it's easier. And you're going to strike that three times. So now we got... Okay. That's going to be a slide, slide up from the 10th fret power chord on onto the 5th string. Slide up to the 7th, or slide down, sorry, to the 7th. That's going to be a slide from the 5th fret power chord on the 5th string, slide up to the 7th, and then you're going to strike the 7th fret power chord. Okay? So it's going to be... Now all together. Now that next, no, now that next little, little riff there, that uh, it's just gonna be you're just gonna have your ring uh, or your pointer finger on the fifth fret fifth string, and your ring finger or whichever finger you want to use on the seventh fret fifth string, and it's just gonna be a lift off from the seventh fret to the fifth fret. And in between, you're gonna throw throw in some palm mutes. So it's gonna be so the pattern is. Then after that, it just goes back into that. Okay. Now that next riff where he uh, says, uh, I f forget what he says, but it's m melodic a little a area there. It's gonna be. Uh, Okay, what that is, it's gonna you're gonna bar down, just bar bar down the third fret with your with your in index finger, and then you're gonna put your uh, your ring finger on the third or, or on the fourth string, fifth fret, and then uh, your pinky on the third string, fifth fifth fret. Okay, and, and and you're just gonna you're gonna alternate pick that 22 times. So it's just gonna be. Okay, then you're gonna slide up to the sixth fret, holding while holding the same thing. You're just gonna slide up to the sixth fret, so you're so you're barring down the sixth fret. It's gonna be 15 times on that. And then it's gonna and then it's, while holding the same thing, you're gonna bar down the second fret, strike that twice. While holding that same thing again, you're gonna slide up to the fifth fret, 
twice, like fast, so, so, then one, one last time. And it'll sound like this. And then it goes back into that, uh, Okay, now with the chorus, uh, where he says, ooh, now call your name. That's fun to play. <laughs> so it's gonna be, you're gonna be chugging on the E string. Okay. It's gonna be six times. First fret, fifth string. Third fret, six, uh, or, uh, so first fret, fifth string. Third fret, sixth string. Okay, so it's gonna be six times chugged. To an E. And that's gonna be, you're just gonna keep on chugging along however many times it is. And the next part, that, uh, okay. It's going to be 1st fret, 5th string, to 2nd, and then a hammer on from 1st fret to 2nd fret to 1st fret. To an E. So now all together we got... Okay, and then the next part is going to be... 1st fret, 5th string, to 2nd, 4th, Bend and release. Now it's going to be a bend, bend, bend and release, and it's going to be up. Okay. Back to the second fret, fifth string, to first, to third. Okay. Okay. Now I'll play the whole thing. Okay, have fun.